The story revolves around Sayaka Kurihara, a young woman living in a monotonous life in Tokyo. She works at an office job that does not inspire her, spends her days alone, and feels disconnected from the vibrancy of the world around her. Her life is devoid of excitement and she is unsure about her future. One night after another mundane day, she stumbles upon something that changes her life completely. A young man collapsed near her apartment door. The man is Itsuki, a stranger who appears weak and hungry despite her initial apprehension. Sayaka brings him inside and gives him food and shelter. As he regains his strength, Itsuki tells her that he is homeless and does not have a job or a place to stay. Intrigued by his gentle demeanor, Sayaka offers to let him stay in her apartment temporarily in exchange for him helping her with household chores. As time passes, Itsuki begins to transform Sayaka's life in unexpected ways. He has a deep knowledge of wild plants and herbs which fascinates Sayaka. Itsuki teaches her about the beauty and usefulness of various wild plants, such as edible weeds and herbs that can be found in everyday surrounding. These lessons on plants parallel a growing emotional bond between the two. Sayaka, who once lived a life of monotony, now finds joy in learning from Itsuki and discovering the simple pleasures of life. The two of them form a comfortable domestic routine and what starts as a purely practical arrangement begins to evolve into something more. Itsuki's quite quite kind nature and his appreciation for the natural world opens Sayaka's eyes to the beauty she had been missing. As they cook the meals together using his wild plants they collect, their bonds grow deeper. Sayaka finds herself, herself falling in love with Itsuki and the atmosphere between them becomes tender and affectionate. However, despite the peaceful life they share, Itsuki remains mysterious about his past. Sayaka knows little about him beyond his current situation and he avoids discussing the reasons for his homelessness. There is a lingering sense of sadness around him that Sayaka cannot quite grasp. Just as their relation begins to gloom and to love, Itsuki suddenly disappears one day without any explanation. Sayaka is left heartbroken and confused, unsure of what happened or if she will ever see him again or not. She reflects on the time they spent together, cherishing the memories but feeling a profound sense of loss. Several months later, Itsuki appears in Sayaka's life again. This time, he reveals the truth about his past. He had been estranged from his family and was wandering aimlessly when Sayaka found him. His departure was necessary for him to reconcile with his past and find a sense of glory. Now that he has resolved his issues, he returns to Sayaka, expressing his feelings for her. In the film's conclusion, Sayaka and Itsuki reunite and their love for each other deepens. They decide to move forward together and cherishing the bond they have built through their shared experiences and the love of nature. The film ends on a hopeful note with Sayaka's life transformed by her relationship with Itsuki and her newfound appreciation for the beauty of the natural world.